All right, guys, so as promised, here's my forbidden math. So it's a long story, but I'm gonna get to it. This is my birth time. I finally discovered it with math. They wouldn't tell me my exact birth time, just my date. So I went nuts, so I was like, nope. So anyways, here's all the laws. You guys have seen this before, so I'm gonna shut up and I'll mention again when it's new stuff. My soulmate, numerology math. Albert Einstein is evidence with his pi formula. My crazy equation. That's my daughter's birthday, and I went nuts trying to find her and outsmart time and astrology, Christianity, and science. And I got you all. I got all you fuckers this time. Because I discovered how to link the sun math with the moon math for time and make a real year. No more leap years, no more other years. It's all one now. People should have listened, but they didn't, so I had to prove it. But I guess I'm happy, so thank you. So look at all these numbers. It's just the highlights. Just look at orange and yellow. That's it. And read the rest. This is Neptune math. This is the moon Triton on Neptune. I love that moon, man. That's our future after en Enceladus or whatever the fuck on Saturn. This is D&D &D dice, man. I love D&D &D dice. It's kind of similar to my triangle equations. So I was like, fuck it. And look at all these sexy numbers, they're all similar, and then I'm like, wait a minute, I want a 33-sided D&D die. Forbidden knowledge. Well, I don't know how to make a 33-sided die. Maybe this one would be cool? I don't know. Anyways, it led me to my back to the answers that I forgot when I started all this years ago. This is my equation. I made it in algebra for you normal people who like letters, I don't. So me and my girlfriend, soulmates, an N for number and F for formula. Think of it that way if you don't want to think of it awesome. Now I'm just going to shut up. This is all me. Just read it. So according to my math, I would have been born on January 12th if the years were all lined up, which would have been exactly half. Flora's born on June 6th. So if I was born on the 12th, it would have been perfect, but according to normal math, it's a day off. But if I'm a day off on my math, what does that mean? Who else is off? There you have it, folks. The Law of Attraction. This is the Nile Flora Love Formula, whatever you want to call it. I'll just call it the Law of Attraction for you sciencey folks. And this is the measurement of light and darkness. Binded or whatever, I'm guessing. It might help us quantum tunnel or travel at light speed. So fuck. And then I'll show you guys all the Jesus math.